yes, right off the bat, there's a couple of stuff we have to talk about for today, so let's do it. What is up everyone, Danny's here, back at it again with another video, but before we get into it, make sure you check out all the links in the description below. And right off the bat, the Steam Deck might be worth it though, it's worth the value, but Nintendo Switch might be better than the Steam Deck, because the Nintendo Switch OLED already came out last year, and the Steam Deck came out this year, and now we have to know which one's better. We all know the Switch is better than all this, all the other Switch games are popular, all this stuff like that. But we have to talk about the value of Steam Deck. The Steam Deck had like, it's like a handheld, just like the Wii U, all this stuff like that. But what we think, the Steam Deck looks like an Xbox home screen. But now, we need to know this. The Steam Deck worth the value like this, the Nintendo Switch. But um, the Nintendo Switch home screen might be better and more better than that value. The Steam Deck might not, might be worth it or not because you know the Nintendo Switch was like the best console ever. But right off the bat, Nintendo might be worried about the, the Steam Deck becoming like a popular handheld than the Nintendo Switch. Would Nintendo be worried about that? No. But I think Nintendo really wants the Switch to be the best selling console ever. The PS2 is actually the best selling console. And you know when Nintendo have that have that um three Nintendo Switches, like if you're a Nintendo fanboy or something, right off the bat, as they know, the Steam Deck might be the best handheld. Like, could it become the best handheld system ever? Like it has a ton of great games. The, the Nintendo Switch, the Steam Deck might have a ton of free games but might not because but you know the steam deck might be worth it the value of that but you know the steam deck might look like it might be a handheld like the nintendo switch it can be like a nintendo switch life but you know something that's just not popular for me i'm not sure if i'm gonna buy a steam deck or not because you know that is like I'm not sure if it's gonna be worth or not because y'all know we just got like a ton of Nintendo Switch games, streaming a lot of Switch games on like Twitch, something like that. But you know, Nintendo Switch games are just worth it, like $60, something like that. But I'm not sure if the Valley Steam Deck is worth it or not. And right off the bat, when people think of the Steam Deck becoming worth it or not, I'm not sure. Is it gonna be worth it or not? I think the Steam Deck might be worth it. Just like the Nintendo Switch, other than that. And um, the Steam Deck might be worth it. I'm not sure, but um, once Nintendo like sees this video, they're gonna know if the Steam Deck is worth it or not. And you know, it's kind of like, the home screen is, the home screen is like, the Xbox Series X home screen, the Xbox One home screen. I think it might look like a PlayStation 4 screen or a PS5 screen, or it might look like the Nintendo Switch screen. And um, now it has like a lot of features the Steam Deck has. And I'm assuming at that point, that is like million people working at that point. And when the Steam Deck is like popular handheld, they think it's gonna be worth it than the Nintendo Switch. I'm assuming the console wars might have to explain it all if the Switch is like pop console. The PS5 was, actually not the PS5, the PlayStation 1 was released back in 1995, but now with the, the NES came out in 1985. So I think the Atari 2600 was the first console ever owned. We all know Google Stadia was shut down forever was discontinued sadly but um the sega dreamcast 1999 so i'm not sure if sega or you know the steam deck is going to be worth it or not it could be worth it 
just like if the Nintendo Switch was worth it then. And now at that point, Nintendo might know that the Steam Deck is going to become a popular handheld because of how how much the Steam Deck, how many units the Steam Deck has sold. And the Nintendo Switch sold like over 100 million units, almost sold to 1 billion units. That is a lot of units that a lot of people get for the Nintendo Switch, like Breath of the Wild, Mario Kart Deluxe, Splatoon 3, every other Nintendo Switch game. And, you know, if you wanted to play online, you need to subscribe to the Nintendo Switch Online service in order to play. And also, if you want to play on 64 games, you need to subscribe to the Nintendo Switch Online expansion pack. So, I think... It could be a gigantic success if the Nintendo Switch was worth it than the Steam Deck. Because if the Steam Deck is worth a lot of money, then the Nintendo Switch, then the Nintendo Switch would be worth it for you. And I am quite understanding with Nintendo and stuff like that. If you made it this far, thank you very much for watching. And let me know, is the Steam Deck worth it or is the Nintendo Switch worth it to you? I want to let you guys know in the comments below, but make sure you guys hit that like button if you enjoyed this video, leave a comment, subscribe if you're new, and I'll talk to you all next time.